Welcome again to Code by Rack channel. Today we will cover step by step instruction and best practices to establish a seamless connection between your Python code and SQL Server. So, in this tutorial, you will have to querying a table from a database, maybe your local database or a remote database, and get the data and print it in a simple way. Let's start. start to install the first library which is Python ODBC which is PY ODBC and I click enter. If uh, the library is already predefined or already installed on your PC or on your machine you don't want to install it yet so you can start programming. We start to import PY ODBC and then I will create the first function which is get data from SQL and I will pass the parameter server. I will pass server database name, username, and password. So now, after I have to pass also the query that we need, let's say select start from table one, table two, table three. Now we start to make a try set up the connection string so connection string connection string it's equal the driver is the driver is capital please make sure that you pass but a driver is capital then i will open for sql server and make sure to make the SQL capital then then I will have to pass the server name which is parameters then I have to pass database which is equal to the database name then I have to pass the UID which is the username the username and lastly the password is pwd equal password okay so now we make the connection string we we set the server name and database name username and password now i have to connect to the sql server the connect is by initializing a con instance py py ODBC dot connect and I will pass the connection string. Next, I will create a cursor, create a cursor to execute the query cursor, cursor equal com dot cursor. Okay, now I have to execute the query and fetch the data cursor dot execute and I will pass the query next I will initialize data variable which is cursor dot fetch all that means the cursor will execute the query and the result of the execution of this query will be populated in data variable now I have to close the cursor Cursor and connection by cursor dot close and cursor and con dot close. This is a very important statement to close the connection and close the cursor each time, or the system or the database will be in a way uh, overloaded. So now I have to return data. Okay. And I will create the accept in case any error happen. py odbc dot error as e. Then I have to print the error. So error. And pass the parameter e. So now print f error. Okay. 
in this like that. Return none. Of course, if there is any error, so you have to return none. Now, I will have to create. I will have to create the main function, which is equal main. Remove the parentheses and open the two point. Now I have to declare the variables for SQL if data. So we will loop it in for loop for row in data. I will print row. So if there is multiple rows, it can be printed. No problem for that. Else print fail to retrieve data from SQL search. Start to execute our SQL query. It's about select star from fax and pass the parameter server database username password in the query. If there is a data, so there is a for a loop to print rows. Now I got all the rows from the database, which is select star. It returns three rows is the database. And now I will make another filter where fac ID equal one, which means it returned only the result in one row. Thank you.